You've heard of criminals stealing cars and bikes, but what about food? It happened to one Spokane family who lost hundreds of dollars in frozen meat to a hungry thief. Good evening and thanks for staying with KXLY. I'm Aaron Luna and this is Nightside. The chicken, beef and sausage would be met for dinner for the next month. The family had it stored in their garage freezer. Now on Nightside, our Kyle Simchuk spoke to the family and gives us tips to keep this from happening to you. Well, you may not realize it, but a garage can be your home's weakest link when it comes to keeping criminals out. It's a lesson one family in Northeast Spokane learned the hard way. Tamara Lear never thought her freezer would be the target of thieves. I came to the garage to grab uh, two pounds of hamburger for spaghetti, and there was no hamburger. It was more than just hamburger missing. Several pot roasts, there was two T-bone steaks, there was a New York strip steak, there was, there was a whole ham. And several bags of chicken all worth about $200. That would have lasted my family a month. Right now, we don't know how we're gonna replace it, but I'm sure we're gonna figure something out. All of it was stolen from inside her garage, and Tamara thinks whoever made it in did so by copying the radio frequency on her garage door clicker. Years ago, ABC News warned of that very thing happening. Spokane police told me they aren't aware of criminals using those devices here, but Tamara and her family aren't taking any more chances. We're just unplugging the main garage door, so there's no entry. We just unplug it. Police recommend keeping your home well lit outside, and if you do have a garage door opener, keep it in a safe place. If your car is parked outside, Outside and a thief breaks in, that clicker becomes an easy way in. If you have an attached garage, an intruder's next step could be inside your home. That's where deadbolts and strong locks come into play. Almost all newer garage door openers come with rolling codes to deter frequency scanners. If you have an old unit, it might be time for an upgrade. Reporting in Spokane, Kyle Simchuk, KXLY4 Nightside.